Again, I gotta get home. <laughs> I don't wanna end it. <laughs> oh no. See, I wasn't expecting to persistently get this good of a haul, but then again I probably shouldn't have gone to the port if I didn't if I kinda wanted not to get a good haul, but Hey, why not? So he he supposedly has an offer on the table for us. And I assume it's a way to get out of here. Which is kinda cool. I didn't know that was a, a feature in the game, if it even is. Yep, I knew that was probably a case. Um, we're actually indeed attacked. So, John's starting to get a cold. <laughs> he no longer has a face. You literally can't see him. You literally cannot see him. Jesus Christ. Of course, I did the hand motion in front of my face. You literally can't see him. Literally. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that portrait. You literally cannot see him. Wow. Well, All right. it was quite the tough group, but we managed to fend them off. Uh, thankfully, we were all armed, none of us were wounded, and the attackers didn't steal anything. Uh, you didn't, you did expend bullets. So it's usually three, I assume, warning shots. Um, yeah, I assume that's what it is. I know there's literal armed militias. That will come for your frickin' ass if you don't watch yourself. Uh, fairly late in the game, so... We're gonna have you eat the last one of those. Then we're gonna have you, of course, get to Betty by Basket. Arnold, you get to... Oh yeah, we actually have a camp here, so you get it. eat. I hate them taking that route. I hate them so much taking that route. God, that's annoying. Especially as somebody who's obsessive about having the doors properly closed behind them. They never do it. They never do it. They never do it. Biography. The boatman Pablo meets Matt gives us the only chance to evacuate. I think we should. Do. I feel like it's a smart idea too, but again, the military, the backstory behind it is that they do end up actually persistently killing everybody and downing the ships and stuff. It's a level of concerning. I'll definitely consider it, though. Uh, people... Oh, think about my offer. Duh! It's to get us out of here. That, that's the point. Uh, people are desperate to get out of Polaroid. I wonder if, though, if the smuggler can be trusted. I automatically... The way he spoke is... I mean, snide as frick, and I appreciate that, but at the same time, that's a dangerous game to be played. So... Uh... I just told you to sleep, didn't I? I guess no, I told that to Pablo. Why don't I bring gang control of Pablo? That's interesting. Alright, um, obviously since we begin, we have plenty of these, and there's plenty more out there. Take that, please, and thank you. And then you will make one of these. More fire wound! We still have more. Okay. Make a couple of those. So you can make a couple of these. There you go. And then you can eat one of them. And then you can sit your fat ass down after you shut the door. Because I am obsessed with that. Oh, right clicking also works that way. Okay. Actually, no. You need to get down there. You need to get up, up to get down. Okay, this way we meet. Okay, you put one in there. I want you to put another. There you go. And grab this to meat. We only have one veggie now. Only one veggie tail. Again, all we can do is put one of those two meat back, which is fine. It's fine. It's good. It's okay. Do this. Go over here. What did you have to say about that? This cow gay probably met at the port might smuggle us out. Do we have enough to Probably not. Although, then again. As your trait says, you are a persuasive son of a bitch. So, yeah, we need another one of these like ASAP because it's actually no, it is actually heating up a lot quicker than I thought it was. I thought it wasn't heating up at all. I was like, this is bow. So it's all the way up to fifty-one. It was thirty-seven before, without the heat. Now it's fifty-one. So that's at least somewhat bearable. All right, need more water. What is our water situation looking like? We actually only have ten water left. What the fudge? You've been using that much? Holy!
we? So now we have 15 water. Wow, I did not know we were using that much water up. Jesus. Okay. So, here's the situation. We could... We could potentially get ourselves smuggled out, or at least take that chance. We do have a lot, but it's a huge ask risk. Not asterisk. Huge ask risk. I... I don't like how big of a risk that really would be. Um, but we could take that, just to see where that leads. If we do take that, I feel like if it fails, either we all die, some of us die, and we're put into a, a near impossible situation, we have to kind of restart from scratch. Which would be interesting for a serious sake, of course. Or, we could just kind of play home sweet home buddies and keep up with what we're doing. Um, I mean, we got a long way to go to the spies for this war. I don't know what I want to do. Wow, that is a really good question, Finn. Right, so, um, there was something else I wanted to make. Can't upgrade either of those further. Um, I can make just about anything now at this point. I can repair that. Oh, duh, I wanted to remake one of these. I wanted to make another one so I could uh, then upgrade it, and then we could have a second one so that I could warm up warmer, because clearly this is going to be a really cold winter. I also want one of these, but I feel like that's considered more of a luxury. Like, yeah, okay, it's kind of cool to have a luxury, because I mean, if you think about it, that helps a lot in a lot of senses, but... Okay, so... Herbs, medication, cheap cigarettes. What I really want... Right, yeah, you gotta upgrade it afterward. That is so freaking expensive, dude. Oh, you know what we also need to make? We need to go, we need to rush over here. We need to make, uh... Uh, also... Okay, we still have 31, because we brought back just as many as we spent. We brought back three, apparently. Um... We could still use a shovel, obviously. Um, I don't know how many lockpicks we have. We definitely need more of these. They're fairly expensive, but I will make them. I'll make at least a few more. Well, let's see. Yeah, they are fairly expensive. I'm not gonna lie. Those are actually that is a pretty expen expensive price tag. You shut that apparently because I was so worried about you getting to sleep. Okay. Priorities. I could, I should probably make another chair. How much does this cost? Eighteen six. I can't remember how much the upgrade cost. I don't think it was too expensive. We could always do with another one of these, or we could try that and then try and upgrade it to a veggie garden. That wouldn't be too bad. But a second one of these wouldn't be too bad either. Um. Sweet baby Jesus. This would be good for morale, obviously. Especially if the person playing it knows what they're doing. Which none of these guys have the ability to do it. So I feel like that means that it's not really that effective, but I don't know. What is this going to be upgraded to? Just to make real meds and do quality skills? Okay. I mean, this this helps in the sense that it gives us more stuff to, to trade. But... I'll use a phenomenon for that. See, that's good too. Oh, we do actually still need a moonshine first though. Alright, well I feel like that's good for morale, but I'm gonna definitely make a chair. Cause we definitely need another place to sit. Wow, okay. Finicky, are we? Jesus, there's not really any place to sit, apparently, in this place. The space you need is apparently ludicrous. Um, can't put 
one here. That would be cool if we could. Put one there, so I will. Always get your beauty up there and build that thing. There you go. Do that. Technically, John should be put to bed. I should have done that a long time ago, but I'm not. If you did not notice. Okay. Pondering whether to make another one of those or not. Um, heaters. It probably is a wise idea, except I don't know if it would help form anything up. And plus, we definitely need a consistent source of fuel. And to be honest, it's kind of tough with that. And then food is a huge, obviously a massively important thing too. Um, veggies are slightly easier to find. And I know we can technically rob those people of their, their veggies that are currently in their garden. Obviously, no doubt, those veggies probably should. Well, I guess not. I mean, they wouldn't automatically grow back, would they? Well, I would assume they could regrow them. See, with this, this is going to be an experiment for me. I don't necessarily want to risk something like that. So, there's no further upgrades on this either. So this is just literally what it already is. Um, I could make that. I could see to make it. I don't really want to do that. If I could do it. It doesn't feel like it's of any importance. But, but yeah, you can figure out what's going on. I guess that gives a slight form of comfort, maybe? But I feel like testing that is probably an important idea. But I don't I don't know. Like if it doesn't actually warm it up further, then I feel like I made a grave error. Um, And then, we already max upgraded this weapons stable, or metal workshop. Sorry, no chillaxing for you, buddy. And we can't upgrade any further, obviously, because it's already an advanced metal workshop. So, all we can do is repair things, basically. Build more bullets, um, in case we need to build these, build that, build this, build that. Like those are those are, ah, oh, it's obviously important, but it's it's at this point it's just kind of I guess we're kind of stuck at a, a very specific point of an interesting juxtaposition where we have to be very selective in what we choose to to make and not make and what we choose to do and what we choose is important or not necessary not necessary all that stuff. Um, actually, yeah, I can't I can't. Re make any more of those uh, barricades yet because there should be a reason to. I could make one of these. It did drop back down to 50, but it is heading towards evening as well. I could try and make a vegetable garden or I could make another small animal truck. But I feel like the veggie gardens probably. It's going to start as an herbal garden, but we want to do it to you grow vegetables if we can. But I feel like a second heater is also very, very, very important. I just kind of want a guitar, too. And if we repair it properly, it... It could potentially be very valuable in trading. I suppose, but... I, I doubt that, uh, that that this could possibly, yeah, this can't like be upgraded or turned into communications radio, it's just hearing things. Oh, this is a weird feeling to be stuck in the middle of different sets of priorities. So what, is it literally... Oh well, no, yeah, it's, 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 it's... Making medicine's important too, but that would mean that we have to make... Well... I don't know, if we upgrade this to be grow vegetables, do we have to build another one for actual herbs? Is it that specific, or... 
Am I just like giving far too much credit to this stuff? I probably gave him far too much credit to this stuff and worrying too much. I feel like you should be able to build safes and stuff, but or mines or something like that. I feel like that makes sense. We spent so much time during this day though. This is the longest day ever I've ever done. I feel like I should build another one of these. And put it on the other side. In the hopes that it actually will warm it up more. If I put it up here, it might be a slightly better option though. It might be. I don't know, but it might be. Or if we put it even higher so it's like up here so that it kinda it's on not only is it over on the opposite side of the house, but it also is up high so that it kind of forces the heat to kind of circulate, I guess, for the rest of the house. Could be a good idea, but I don't know. This could be a complete resource drain that's useless. I'm scared that it is. Plus, see, here's another thing: is that we consistently need that would be we need that much more fuel. We would need that much more fuel. And we could potentially sustain that. We could potentially do that. I'm gonna go with it and I'm gonna do it anyway. Because... Pavle, upgrade it please. Oh, wait, we need the thermometer first. You see an ammo here. Because <laughs> the doors are open, suddenly that's the faster route. That's interesting. Um, we need a thermometer. We are back down to two electronics. So we're using them slightly more frequently than I figured we would. That's fine. That is no big deal. No, no, whatsoever. So this is in the hopes that this will actually help. This will actually help heat uh, things up better. So we're gonna have you go right back down. Well, no. We're gonna have you go to sit in this chair. We're gonna have, not you, we're gonna have Arnold. Arnold Schwarzenegger. We're gonna have you go down here. And we're gonna have you make more fuel, please. So we can apply some more fire with more fire. Yeah, so thank you. Um, right, we don't need it. This is about the design. Fuck it. All of that poor, poor, Drain supply of components. We're, we went up to 40, 42, I think, and we're all the way back down to, I think, 6, I believe, is what it was. Is it teleport, please? Thank you. Step it in there. Step it in there. Thank you. Oh, yeah, that actually does. That's That actually does help uh, heat it up faster. I am very glad and proud about that. I'm more glad than a rag. Uh huh, glad rag trip. And then, I don't, I told you to I shut the door. Don't be an ass when I tell you to shut the door, please. Thank you. Make me paranoid, Arnold. All right. This will be the final night, because I need to go somewhere that I know I'm not gonna have the greatest night, and that I can, I can say, hey, okay. I had an okay night. Not the greatest, not the worst. Uh, no, the decrypt squad actually is the place of the homeless. What am I saying? Um, I thought this was it for some reason. But, um, yeah. So we're gonna go somewhere that's, we know is pretty, pretty well looted, I guess. But still has some things that we could use. 
just in the sense that we know that since we're gonna end it in the morning. In the morning. Um. Yeah. Then it'll automatically. That means we'll also start the next episode in the morning. It'll also automatically shuffle and alternate whatever supplies we end up grabbing. Will suddenly be changed. Oh, I sent John Cena out, and I did not send anybody on guard. Well, hopefully that door really works, and they, I mean, they really spring into action this time, because... Boy. Boy, howdy, if that, if we, if we fubber knock this up. That's a really sad place to end. Although, I guess it does alternate everything else as well, so... I guess it wouldn't be the, the worst case scenario. It normally would be, but... So. I have a lock pick. Oh, I just used the lock pick. I needed two lock picks. And there's no way I can get up there. There's no way I can get up there without a lock pick. So that's already the, pretty much the end of the story. I'll take another book. That's not a bad thing. I'll definitely take the electronics because that's always needed. I'll take the foil papers because that's important. I'll take quality roll up because that is also good and then why not we already have a bon overabundance of sugar we might as well take 10 more that way it's even a more creative resource and then we can just head on there you go we were raided ah! probably like oh somebody has a deep wound despite all of your wonderful weaponry and armor it is getting very cold Day 16 is the day that winter officially sets in. And here's all the snow. <gasps> Egots! Oh! There's another thing. Why can't we make uh, different clothing so that it's more warm? That's a good thing. The wonder what? That's calm. Okay. Okay. I mean, that's, that's not worse. It's not too bad. Wait. Do you say there's two in here? That one is still burning. This one I don't see burning at all. It also is 46, so... Hmm. Alright, well, you're gonna go do this. Uh, <laughs> we need to make fire rate, please. Plus. Plus. Only 40 wood. Only 6 components still. We can make one of the books into firewood. So these, these will automatically take two anyway. They'll burn with one, even though technically they take two. Oh man, this is getting bad. I mean, it's not the worst case scenario. Again, it really isn't, but... Oh boy, it's getting scary. That didn't help warm it up either, any further. But this is clearly still burning. I mean, you can tell that. But it didn't help warm it up any further. So this is getting a little bit dangerous. Yeah, there we go. Go to bed. These two already slept, so it's cool that it was calm because, yeah, I know it is. Okay, it's 51. It's starting to warm up again. Good, 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 good. Um, ah, we need to make more fuel. See, that's another thing about this, is that even for food, we need that fuel. So, I mean, we're needing to expend so much fuel. I was not thinking it was a very, a very good, uh... I feel like that should be boarded up. It's wide open, there's no door. Doesn't feel right. Anyway, um... 51. It shouldn't be that cold to you guys. Oh, Franco's here. Go figure. Guess who's asleep? <laughs> oh, well. It happens, man. It happens. Oh, no, please. Take your time. Oh, it went down again. Oh, no. No, it didn't go out. Okay, I figured it did, but it didn't. I like that we can shovel that. Oh, we can make a snowman! Oh, that makes me so happy! He's probably, if anybody sent anybody out to do that, it's like, 
and you're dead. <laughs> it's a snipe, like, fuck my life. Who would bait me? You could chase me. Um, let's see. I think these are way more expensive than these. Although that's because these don't resource drain. Yeah, you're gonna be running out of resources yourself here because, especially wood burning, because uh, people are gonna want that because it's cold weather. I know it's gonna cost me a hell of a lot, but we do have these. And we do have a these. And we do have a this. And we do have a that. And we do. Okay, it's not that expensive for what I'm offering. Come now. Rude. What I was gonna do, I was gonna give him one of these. If not all of them. Now it's very generous, apparently. Oh, very, very generous. Bad that is suddenly, you're trying to scam me out of everything I have. Oh, I can't take all of it. <gasps> oh, that's cool. I know I'm not gonna be able to do it if I try and take something like that. That's being greedy. Oops, I sent something back. I did not mean to. I think no, I didn't. Okay. Um, that's definitely. I mean, that's almost all of the valuables we have, except for one alcohol, ten more gunpowder, and one more uh, guitar. That's basically everything we had just for fuel and stuff, which is fine, but. See you later, Franco. See, digging out a cylinder doesn't make too much sense to me. Oh, but it's because you can make it into water. Ah, that makes perfect sense. Oh, I can just go perpetually here. That doesn't seem smart though, but it's not gonna take any time to do it apparently at all. That's cool. I'm gonna make a snowman though. I'm gonna get sniped doing this, but I'm gonna do it. Oh no, that's gonna take so long. That's dangerous. Hey, look, it's thunder snow. That's cool. Do you wanna build a snowman in the middle of a war zone? Taking you 70 years because you're apparently incompetent at making it. Yeah, I was gonna end this on this day, and I still am. Which means all of this will probably be completely redundant and gone. But. I think it will be. So you know what? As much as this would be cool, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... In fact, I don't even think Franco's... Uh... Visit will even be valid anymore. It's gonna suddenly... Yeah, it won't. It's gonna reset the day. Um... So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this super episode of... Uh... The mega episode. Super mega. Super ultra mega episode of, uh... This War of Mine. Revamped! And if you did, please do leave a lick. Kermit in submarine sandwich is very, very much appreciated. It is very delectable. Very delicious. It's very fantastic. It's very fantastic. I do very much appreciate it. So, uh, thank you, everybody, for so much for watching. And I hope to see you all in the next video. Good day, everybody.